Hey guys, welcome to the channel. We spent uh, last night here in Cl uh, Clarkston, Washington. in a motel as uh, the BMW was getting fixed at the dealership and now he's we on a roll again but the plan is totally changed we will still head uh, and explore now a little bit of Washington instead of Idaho because there's no point of heading back the plan is uh, today to go towards Yakima Washington we haven't been in this area at all we will make the best out of this trip, whatever is left. We, I believe we have another five days uh, to hang around here. Stay tuned. Uh, I'll try to film as much as I can and uh, whatever is interesting on the, on the road and uh, whenever we stop somewhere. If you are watching and if you enjoy the content here, don't forget to like the content, comment down below and subscribe to the channel and follow my adventures and uh, rides. As always, appreciate it uh, to any subscribers that are already subscribed and uh, staying with me on the channel. Thank you very much. So let's enjoy the ride and uh, let's hope no more issue because this trip has been uh, probably the most unique trip that we ever had. Uh, we've been riding pretty much every year for for a longer adventures like this, but this year it's one thing after another. So things are changing quickly and we're changing the plans left and right. We don't follow we don't follow the original schedule whatsoever. So it is what it is, unfortunately. But yeah, like I said, it looks like a, another trouble. We're stuck at 32 degrees and there's an accident in front of us. Didn't go far out of Clarkstone. Uh, just uh, maybe a couple miles and uh, we're sitting in, <laughs> in an open field. <laughs> now we will be roasting alive. <laughs> like I said, this trip is something specific. <laughs> it's an adventure, not a trip. <laughs> it's, a, it's an adventure. I don't know if you can call that an adventure anymore. This is the hold up, whatever that is, we'll find out. Okay, there is one car that's uh, slightly... Airbags are exploded. There's a Range Rover. Was it a multi-car collision? No, two cars. I think that uh, Range Rover and uh, whatever the other car was. Oh, there is, there is a motorcycle accident. That's where it is. Oh my gosh. So in the ditch, it's pretty bad. It's pretty bad, man. Right on the side of the mountains. That was a BMW. RT, yes. RT or similar something. Approaching Walla Walla. Not sure what is this city all about, but I guess we'll find out. Hopefully. Oh, there's a plane starting right now. It looks like it's an older town, too. All the buildings are older. That's the main street here.
so we just uh, shortly outside Walla Walla we have approached uh, this section here along the so along the side of Columbia River it's a quite big river that goes right into the ocean from here so the elevation dropped here to 500 uh, feet and uh, we are heading down on US Highway 730 towards uh, Big Junction. That's the first stretch and uh, end of our day today. It's uh, almost unbelievable that uh, in uh, such a desert all around, the world, a big river like this uh, appeared from nowhere. And the rock is also changed, it's all black. Quite interesting. And finally some scenery, after we like left Clarkston, there was big nothing for quite some time, like a bunch of fields with wheat and uh, other uh, agricultural area, uh, flat on the table, and we're entering Oregon right now. Uh, travel to, for today is uh, 104 miles left, uh, more or less to the destinations and we're looking at 38 degrees celsius i think that this is the hottest that i've been at on this trip it is warm bogdan decided to take the jacket out So we just pulled in along the pool outside uh, site or a recreational site uh, along the shore of Columbia River. Going to check it out. The kids are swimming and the boys are getting ready to swim. I think I'll pass this time because I left my shorts on a tree somewhere in Idaho while drying. So I gotta pick up a pair of shorts somewhere, if it's even possible, on the way here. Uh, I should have looked it up uh, in, in uh, Walla Walla. We had a nice swim, got the t-shirt wet, and now we're rolling again another 94 miles ahead of us, more or less. It looks like a burned area. There we go, finally we can see the bark on this river for a bit. following uh, I-84 west to Blanac Canyon or close to it more catchy appearance
all that stuff is coming from the coast into the states from the shipyard or port I should say from the port just passed big junction now it's time to look for a campground it is close six o'clock or somewhere on that time yeah seven o'clock we finally made it uh, at the end of the day to the campsite we managed to find the state park the Schutz River just in Oregon and it's right on the river as you see behind me there's a river um, we can have a little swim in there and uh, the the camp is already set up uh, after a really hot day of riding first thing what we did uh, we went into the river to cool off because that was just insane 38 39 degrees celsius all day long and uh, we were pushing uh, we only did about 300 miles since we started uh, riding um, around 1 p.m and here right now we're looking at 8 p.m so with the few stops along the way for taking photos of course and some video and uh, so some of the first section there was not much of a scenery and unfortunate ac accident of the biker crashing into the rocks i have a feeling the bike was totally totaled um, that's uh, really sad to see somebody i hope he made it out of it but it didn't look good because the bike was so mangled so it's uh, it's hard to say what really happened because we, there was a lot of police on the scene and emergency vehicles so we just uh, went through and uh, continue on there and the first section after that was like uh, all the farmlands and and uh, agriculture uh, after a while it turned into uh, i think that was a walla walla it started uh, showing off some mountains and a very similar environment to what i've seen in nevada and parts of arizona but i wouldn't expect that it was so hot out here that's unplanned and the whole thing uh, the whole ride into the state was also not on our agenda at all if you're following my videos the plans are changing very often and especially when stuff goes wrong with the bikes then we have to uh, think different ways to to go around uh, the trouble to still enjoy the rest of the ride so that's the idea so at this point uh, we will finish up setting up and we'll call it a day for uh, for tonight um, maybe we'll have a couple of beers because a friend of mine robert he went uh, to get a beer run we'll have a couple of beers before bedtime and tomorrow it's going to be another day full of uh, another adventure